Well, hello, friends. Uh, we have a lot going on at the Westover Hills Church of Christ. Uh, we've been, you've been busy. Very busy. I'm here. It's it's almost four. I'm still here. It, it is. Uh, but we have a lot of things that are very important for you to know about. Um, one of the things that uh, is going to happen different, there's a lot that's different. Mm -hmm. um, one of the things that's very different is that uh, this will be our second week having our worship service specifically and only online. Uh, and this week, one of the things that we're going to do different from last week is that we've been working very diligently to try to get uh, an online offering for our growth groups. And it looks like this Sunday, we're going to have our growth groups uh, available online using Zoom. You've used Zoom before. Yes, Zoom is great. You've probably heard about it through all your social media looking at. Um, but yeah, Zoom is awesome, and it'll be a great, great resource for our growth groups. So it'll be, we're assuming just about everyone is going to be at 9 o'clock in the morning, so the hour before our 10 o'clock worship service. Um, for more information, if you're not in a growth group, email info, info at, at westover.org. Westover. Uh, you will get specific instructions probably later in this week from your growth group leader about how to jump in on that. But plan on growth group at 9, worship at 10. Now, we've got a lot going on for our young people, don't we? Yes, we do. So our children, um, we've got Adam and Denise um, and Kaylin uh, providing uh, different resources and lessons on Facebook. So if you're not following uh, Westover Kids on Facebook, you should go ahead and like that page uh, and follow that page. When you like it, do you follow or do you follow? L love it or like it. Love it or, or like it. it. Just no sad faces. No. Um, and then for youth, uh, on Sunday night when we would usually have our huddles and middle school camp, our huddle leaders will be uh, facilitating um, their own huddle uh, through FaceTime. Um, so even if you don't have an iPhone, uh, lots of you have uh, ways to get online and to download that app to get involved uh, in our huddles there. And for our middle schoolers, I'll be hosting a uh, YouTube Live um, on our Westover Youth YouTube account. At, and both of those will start at 6 p.m. on Sunday nights. And YouTube's on the internet, isn't it? YouTube is on the internet. Okay. So we've got family devotionals that are being sent out from you mm -hmm. and the Pimentails. Mm -hmm. uh, for our kids, there are packets that uh, Adam and Denise are sending out. Mm -hmm. uh, they can email those to you if you have a printer at home. I guess not everyone has a printer. Yeah, so... Yeah, and they're mailing as well mm -hmm. uh, through snail mail. And then mm -hmm. also you can come and pick those up here at the building if you so choose. And for Sunday, there is a one-page form that will be emailed out. But if you aren't on the email list, you know how you can get on the email list? You email info at westover.org. Exactly. Okay, so uh, students, kids, a lot of stuff for them. Growth group is new. Uh, one thing that might be different is we're really trying hard to get a Roku channel set up for this Sunday. Can you explain what a Roku channel is? Uh, a Roku channel, to my understanding, which is limited, uh, is a little USB HDMI thing you stick in your TV or maybe into the VCR. I'm not really sure. But then all of a sudden... Roku happens. Yeah, that's that's a great descriptor of what Roku is. Uh, but there's an actual channel. If you have a Roku, it is a, a streaming stick like Andrew so adroitly described. And y you can use that to watch the service on your TV. So if you don't want to watch it on your, your phone or your tablet or your computer, if you use the Roku app, uh, there will be a Westover channel. We're really trying to get that done. It's not done by right now, Wednesday evening, but hopefully by this Sunday, it will be there so you can watch on your TV. But we really want you to use, uh, even if you're watching the Roku channel on your TV, use Facebook uh, live on your phone. You know why? Because what can you do? Because you can comment in when we do prayers of the people. Exactly. You can respond to other people watching. You can give encouragement, mm -hmm. uh, give some amens and some prayer requests. Exactly. So, uh, Roku channel, watch on your TV, but use Facebook Live to interact with the rest of the church. Because one of the things that we really want to have experience is that we are isolated, uh, even though we're not six feet right now. Um, most of us are obeying those things, and we are physically isolated, but, but through the beauty of technology, we can have some sort of participation and connection to each other through the growth groups, through Facebook Live discussions, through uh, the stuff on YouTube that you guys are doing, mm -hmm. which that's... YouTube's very exciting. Now, there's also another way that you can participate uh, through online giving. Uh, since uh, most of us aren't going to be in the room, and by most I mean everyone isn't going to be in the room, and if you want to still uh, support the work of God through this church, through your offering, uh, obviously now is a great opportunity for you to go go to our website. The online giving information is right there. You can click on it, and you can worship that way through online giving. 
Anything else we need to tell them, Andrew? Uh, we love you. We love you. Yeah, that's true. Uh, this is a uh, it is a very unique opportunity for us. This is a, a weird time. It's unprecedented. It's something that n none of us have ever experienced before. Uh, but we believe this is a great opportunity for our families, uh, for our uh, for our entire church. Um, to grow because we think this isn't something that God is afraid of, but that, that God is actually using this to form us more into mm -hmm. God's image. And uh, we think this is a great opportunity for all of us, especially those of us who have kids, uh, to double down on our job as disciplers of our kids. Mm -hmm. And we as a church are trying to give you all the resources we can to help make that as, uh, as seamless as possible. Um, but all of us parents, we're going to have to step up and we're going to do some great work. But uh, we do love you. Thank you for checking in. Uh, we will look forward to seeing you digitally soon, in person. When is it going to be? At some point. At some point. All right.